Chemistry is the science dealing with the structure and properties of substances, the transformations they undergo, and the energy that is absorbed or released during these transformations. Chemistry deals with the building blocks of our world and explains how they are put together, how they fall apart, and how energy is produced or consumed in the process. We study chemistry, for example, to find out how water is formed out of hydrogen and oxygen and why metal rusts in the winter. So what do chemists do? We can break their activities up into three basic categories. Chemists explain phenomena, showing how and why things happen. Chemists analyze substances to determine their chemical makeup. Chemists synthesize new substances, such as medicines and new materials. In this course module, we will focus on a specific case study arsenic contamination in the drinking water in Bangladesh. We will see how chemists are helping address this problem, which is a serious health issue affecting millions of people. Chemistry is often referred to as the central science, since it links both physics and biology and plays a critical role in medicine and engineering. We hope this case study will give you insight into the important role chemistry plays in modern society. Of the three main activities of chemists, Analysis is of particular importance for this case study since chemists must examine the water for arsenic contamination. Chemical analysis falls into two general categories. Qualitative analysis, determining what substances are made of, and quantitative analysis, determining how much of each substance is present. Below you'll see how chemists use qualitative analysis to determine the form arsenic takes in the drinking water. We'll also use various quantitative analysis techniques to determine the amount of arsenic in the water, letting us find out if the water is safe to drink.